This is a 2D kitty, a April Fool's pet that exists inside of Adopt Me. But a 2D kitty isn't enough for me, which is why I want to make a 2D bat dragon and five other 2D pets that don't exist in Adopt Me yet to find out what we might get in April Fools in Adopt Me. So this is what the 2D kitty looks like, but I want to go and design my own. And to do so, I actually have to draw out a bat dragon. So we're gonna test my drawing skills. So I'm gonna start off with like the head of the bat dragon. So this is gonna be the bat dragon's eye. Then we're gonna go for the nose, which I think is also small. And we're kind of gonna connect it like this. So it turns out drawing a bat dragon is a lot harder than I thought which kind of makes sense now, to be honest. I was kind of hoping this would be like really easy to draw, but um, I've only done a head. Now we need to go and draw the body. Honestly, I've got no idea what the shape looks like. I think it's like this. And then we kind of connect that. Oh dear, this is gonna look bad. Maybe I should have done like the wings. I just realized I committed to drawing five different pets. And honestly, this is gonna be kind of interesting. If you like drawing, then let me know in the comments as, um, this is questionable. You can rank my drawings in the comments and tell me which of the five is like the best one. Because honestly, I think they're all going to be pretty bad. I think these wings are way too thick. But you know what? We need a bat dragon's wing. So we're going to go like this. Oh, this is actually terrible but you know what it will have to do for now yeah we definitely made this way too big what have i done a bat dragon has like a little tail with a ball on it i think at least the 2d pets don't need coloring in they're literally just black and white which uh saves me a lot maybe what's missing is the feet so we're gonna draw them next by just drawing this it's pretty simple to draw dot me feet you literally just do like half a circle and then connect it like this. I think this might maybe save it. Okay, this kind of does look like a bat dragon now. I wouldn't quote me to that. Now we need the other wings. So we just kind of got to copy the same thing that I kind of drew over there. And then connect that to this piece. And then that goes like this. Yeah, this whole wing is terrible. We got to connect it like this. I wonder if this is how Adopt Me makes their pets. <laughs> but once we finish drawing it, the pet is actually going to come to life and we can have it as an actual pet. I think I need to fix the wings a little bit. So we can kind of just rub these little bits out with the rubber. All right, I think this will do for now as my first pet. Then I'm going to press the spawn button and actually turn it into a pet. So this right here is about to spawn in my pet. 2D Bat Dragon. Look at that thing. Oh my god. It follows me. Yeah, that's right. I have an actual 2D Bat Dragon as a pet. And uh, it's just chilling. It follows me. It does everything that a real Adopt Me pet would do. And uh, that is what a 2D Bat Dragon would actually look like. I think I can actually turn into it. I kind of want to become the 2D Bat Dragon. So here we go. This is what it is like if you wanted to become a 2D Bat Dragon with a baby Bat Dragon behind it. This is kind of fun though, to be fair. I like the fact that I can literally just draw something and then become it. Honestly, it's a very strange game, but hey, this is pretty fun to be fair. Now we have made one pet. We need to make some more. So that means we have to delete all of this. So next, we're actually going to go and do like a little tutorial on how you can all go and draw a unicorn. So start off by drawing the horn like this. Then you want to do is draw the ears. So we're kind of going to go curved like this and then connect this line here. Then you want to go and connect the lines here for the head. And we're currently drawing the head in case you couldn't tell. It kind of goes around like this and creates the nose here. Then you draw around and draw a cheek and then connect that back up. Hey, that looks acceptable. And then we need to draw the eye. So as for the eye, we're going to draw a circle and then maybe a little circle inside the circle. And we need the other eye, which is going to go right here. And then as for the next bit, we draw another ear right here. Then we need like the hair because unicorns have this nice hair. So we kind of go like this, bring it up, then bring it back in. We're going to repeat that, draw it out, and then bring it back in. And then it actually has a third little tuft on unicorns, which is right here. Then we kind of want to draw the body. So we're going to start from here, bring it around and like literally just a circular shape, bring it up and then dip it a bit 
kind of like a little jelly bean and then connect it up right here then we got to do those classic adopt me feet which is like the weird shape honestly i don't know how you describe this shape but you just just draw it i guess yeah i'm a great teacher trust me you gotta draw it connect it obviously we need four feet i mean you can draw five if you want but <laughs> then we need the unicorn's tail and for the tail it's pretty similar to the hair you kind of go up and around and swoosh it and it looks like this and then you connect that around is the unicorn tail only like two pieces i don't know and um because we can we're gonna draw the eye in on this this might ruin it honestly i do not know but i want to see a little bit of full coloring in because um because we can so we're gonna just do that we're not gonna add color and then we're gonna press spawn and we're gonna set that as a pet so now i will have a pet baby unicorn that follows me Look at that, we have a little army of 2D pets. So far we have the Bat Dragon and the Unicorn. I think it is now time that we become it. So we're gonna morph into our lovely Unicorn. And there we go. This is what it would look like if Adopt Me added a 2D Unicorn into the game. It's pretty fun to be fair. I mean, if they add a 2D kitty in the past and they might be bringing it back, it would make sense for them to add like a 2D pet of some of the other coolest pets. So this is my little April Fool's pranks prank pets. And I kind of like this one. I like it. Um, Very cool looking pet. All right. So that is pet two. Now let's move on to pet three. For pet three, we are going to go and attempt to draw a dragon. So we're going to go and start off with the eye. As I feel like starting off with an eye always like helps. And okay. Yeah, this is actually horrible. I have no idea how to draw a dragon. So I would not trust my drawing skills. We're trying to draw the horns now. Honestly, this is uh, going to look very derpy, which hey, might work. Maybe some of you guys like ugly looking pets. We've then got to go and draw the body of this dragon. This doesn't look like an adult me dragon. We kind of just draw the body like this. Honestly, this is shocking. Then we're going to draw the feet here this time. I think might work with the perspective. Honestly, I have no idea. Then dragons have a body that goes down like this. And then we've got to draw the wings. So for the wings, it kind of goes like this and then out. Then I believe there's like three little spiky bits like this. And then we kind of connect it like that. Now I need to rub out this part. I really hope you appreciate my drawing skills because I don't think anyone ever will. So let's connect this this and um voila we got the, <laughs> the dragon is we kind of got to do another set of wings so it's gonna yeah go like that and that and picasso yeah that's what they call me guys why does this look ugly i think we are getting progressively worse by the way like um we definitely started off with the best oh bro yeah you can tell it's broke look at its eyes Look at its eye. Why is its eye separated? We have, we've lost its eye. We, we lost the eye. I want to become it. Um, I guess we'll... <laughs> Bro, it's so broken. Look at him. Even my own drawing is broken. <laughs> What's happening to him? Bro, my, my little dragon. Why are you, why are you doing this? You know what? We'll move on to the next one. We're going to save that. Yeah, these are progressively getting worse. I don't want to know what number five looks like. Next, I will draw a pet and I need you to try and guess what pet I am drawing. That's right. I'm not going to tell you. You just simply have to guess, which might make this a very difficult challenge for most of you. As honestly, I couldn't confirm if this is going to be good or not. So we're going to draw an eye right here and then an other eye right here. I'm using like a little mouse to draw and most people normally use like a drawing tablet. I must confess using a mouse is not easy. Now we're going to draw some little eyebrows. 
Yeah, we didn't draw eyebrows on any of the other pads, so that's interesting. We need to bring the smile up a little bit like this, then kind of draw outwards and then connect it here bro this is gonna look so bad if you can comment what this is right now then congratulations you win i'm not gonna tell anyone what this is and if you can guess in the comments i'm gonna pick someone and give them this pet you've just got to guess what it is i'm not gonna tell you what i am drawing right now you just gotta guess all right i want to see if you can tell what i'm trying to draw as honestly if you can congrats you deserve an award so go on comment right now what you think i am drawing i bet none of you guys are gonna guess this now i need to go and do like some arms i don't know how big to make an adopt me pets arms uh we're gonna go like this uh, yeah comment right now on the video if you guys can guess what this is then congrats i think this kind of looks okay i don't know if it looks like an adopt me pet maybe we need to color in the eyes to make it look like an adopt me pet because that is like the classic adopt me style you know you need like the colored in eyeballs kind of go like this and this yeah i'm not sure about this one it kind of goes down i think the proportions on this are actually shockingly bad and you guess what this is if you can then let me know this this kind of looks okay i think that looks all right maybe maybe this looks shocking this this could have gone so much better we're gonna save this as the fourth pet if you can guess what i have just drawn then congrats i'm gonna have it as a pet and then we're gonna become it you know um i'm the weird dragon with a new pet where is my pet gone before we go and do the next drawing check out this my new merch is just released you can check it out on madebycookie.com and i'm adding everyone who orders as a friend on roblox simply just send me proof that you made the order and i will add you as a friend this one even has a little cookie on it for the last drawing, I'm going to attempt to draw a cow. So we're going to start off by drawing the nose. And ooh, that was actually a really satisfying nose. Then we're going to draw these little nostrils, which is um what you, you breathe out of like this. I'm going to try and draw the head all at once and see if that works. I don't know. That's too small, right? Then we're going to draw the eyeball right about here. And then the other one can go just here. Now what I need to do is kind of draw the eye bit that the cows have. That looks like a fried egg. Are you kidding me? Have I just drawn a fried egg? Then we need to draw these little horns. Yeah, Dummy Cow has horns, believe it or not. Then you kind of got to draw the ear, which looks like this. And then the second ear goes here and connects around like, <laughs> not like that. Then we draw the body, which is just again, pretty similar to all of the other ones. It's just an oval shape. We draw the classic adopt me feet. And then we kind of go to draw the, the spots, like the cow markings, which kind of look like this. And then there's like a little marking here and then like a, a little mark in here and ta-da we have now successfully drawn five 2d adopt me pets if you want to use this as a tutorial on how to draw pets slightly questionable if you think this looks like one then let me know in the comments and uh try and guess what my fourth pet was also if you want adopt me to add any of these as actual pets make sure to uh tell them <laughs> You need to click here to see me rate the best Adopt Me houses. Some of these are absolutely insane and you need to check these out. Or click the button on the left to check out my merch. And if you order, I'll add you as a friend.